around, got the whole thing wobbing. What is going on YouTube, it's Minty here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to remove the Xbox application from Windows 10. Now, this has helped me with where my application would not open, the Xbox app would not open on Windows 10, and I looked, I did some research and I figured out how to delete it, so I'm going to show you guys how to today. So what you want to do is you want to open up PowerShell, Windows PowerShell, it's a desktop, desktop application on Windows 10. And then you want to type in this right here. I will leave this in the description below so you can copy and paste it. You want to just copy it, go to your PowerShell, paste it, and then click enter. And it'll initialize or whatever it does. And then that's it's done. And if you look here, the Xbox app, I didn't show this before, but it was here and now it's gone. If you try opening it up, it's not going to work. So what you want to do then is you want to go to the store. You want to go to your Windows store and type in Xbox in the first one right here and click install. Now sometimes this does not install the first time it'll say like an error code. Yeah, see, try that again. See details and it has this error code right here. Uh, don't worry about that. All you need to do is you just need to exit that out and then you need to restart your computer okay so I'm gonna go ahead and exit this stuff out and I'll see you guys when I restart my computer alright what is going on guys I'm back so before I showed you guys that Xbox app wouldn't install there was like an error code and I said you just need to restart your computer so I've restarted my computer and I'm gonna show you guys how so you want to click on the Xbox app and it'll show it probably in your recently added right here and then when you get here it'll say starting download it'll start to download installing 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 and it has completed so then you can exit off and then it says recently added you can pin that to your start again move it back up here where I had it and then it'll open perfectly fine I'm going to show you guys, I'm going to go ahead and sign in, show you guys that everything is working fine on the application. And before I couldn't even sign in to the application, it wasn't that it couldn't open, it's just that it couldn't sign in. And then I did this and now it's signed in. So I can pretty much do anything I could before. So everything's fine. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and please like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Instagram and Twitter. And I have a new Twitch up, so I'll be live streaming soon, very soon. And I'll see you guys next time.